Welcome to another Versand training video. Today we're going to cover part E, story retelling for the Versand speaking test. In this section, you will listen to three short stories and then you'll be asked to describe them in 30 seconds, providing as many details as you can. Now, let me give you some tips. Number one, it all comes down to your training. So work on your vocabulary. Remember, when, when you hear a voice, when you hear a word that you don't know, all you hear is noise. For example, listen to this, the word Beispiel. Beispiel, what's that? Well, <laughs> that's example in German. Maybe you didn't know that, so that was noise for you. And well, I'm gonna leave some links in the description section of this video that will help you work on your vocabulary. Now, the second tip is identify the four basic elements of the story. First one is characters. Second one, settings. Third one, characters' goals or actions. And the fourth one, the outcome, the end of the story. That's what you want to mention in your answer. Another tip I have is, as in other sections of the exam, speak loud and clear. My next tip is master the past tenses and also simple present and present continuous. And one more thing, relative clauses. That's something that can come in handy for your answer. And finally, be focused. Block the rest of the world and take one story at a time and retell it. That's it. Okay, I'm gonna read the sentences for you and then you'll have your 30 seconds to retell them. Thomas was in his apartment and decided to make pizza for dinner. He had all the ingredients but tomatoes and olives. So he asked his neighbor for some, but his neighbor had already used up all his tomatoes and olives on a pizza he made for himself. Fortunately, Thomas's neighbor is very kind and invited him over for dinner. Lucy had been working on an essay for two hours when she realized she had forgotten to call her sister for her birthday. She took her cell phone and called her immediately. Her sister told her that it was okay, since her birthday was not until next month. They both had a good laugh. Troy had a job interview for the position of sales clerk in a local bookstore. He was nervous and lacked confidence. When he arrived in the interview, a friend of his was buying a book and gave him some advice to feel more at ease. He felt better after talking to his friend and did quite well in the interview.
I bet you did well. That was part E, story retelling. Keep working on your English, contact me if you would like to train with me for the test or simply boost your English. And what section of the test should I cover next? Let me know in the comments below. Like, subscribe and share. There's a new video every week. Have a nice day.